Hey everyone, Stefan here over at Rotive. Today I want to show you a quick example on how to create a dynamic list that's looking for cold prospects, people that have not been engaging in your marketing efforts. So remember, people that haven't been engaging, they're going to have that little red icon next to their name and it would say you know, never active. They haven't done anything to mark them as an active prospect. And of course, the little green green icon that's going to show that that person has been active at some point in time while being in the database. So let's go ahead and create a rule that's looking for prospects that have not been active for one full year. So as you can see, I've already created that list, All right, called it cold prospects, not active for one year. And again, this is going to be a dynamic list. So let's go ahead and set the logic. We'll go ahead and add a rule. We'll scroll down to prospect time. We'll choose last activity days ago. And then you have a couple of other options, but we want to leave it as is greater than. And then we'll type in 365, right? A full year. So now this logic is going to be running and looking for people that have not been active for a full year. If somebody has not been active for a full year, they'll automatically be added to this list. Now, what do we want to do with this list, right? It's up to you guys if you, you know, you want to delete people that have just not been interacting with anything, you know, they're not, you know, opening your emails, they're not clicking links, they're not going to your website, they're not filling out forms. I mean, you know, they're not doing anything. So a couple of things that we can do. What I like to do with cold prospects is I like to add them to an engagement program in which that would be used to warm them up over time. And that would just be, you know, sending email after email after email and waiting for them to interact with that email, clicking a link, which would then make them as an active prospect. So the cool thing about that is, remember, it's a dynamic list. So if you match the criteria, you're added to it. And if you don't match it, you're automatically removed from it. So since this dynamic list is looking for people that have not been active within a year, they'll be added to it. But right once they become active by clicking a link or doing any other type of engagement, that means they're automatically removed from the list, which means they're also going to be removed from the engagement program right? They're no longer considered as a cold prospect. So going into our engagement studio, I already have one created, right? I'm calling it re-engaging cold prospects. And you can see the list that I'm using is the dynamic one that I created earlier, cold prospects, not active for one year. So again, just to recap, whenever somebody has reached that 365th day of not being active in your part out instance, they're automatically added to that list, which means they're automatically added to this program and they're going to receive this first email. And, you know, when it comes to, you know, drip programs or engagement programs like this, where you're warming people up, you're more than likely just sending emails. You're not looking for activity. You're not branching out with this type of program. You're just looking to, you know, capture their attention somehow and, you know, entice them to interact with the content within it, which again would mark them as an active prospect, which means they're you know, no longer on that dynamic list and they're not in this program anymore. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us. But other than that, have a great day.